come down and uh, film these we go in between a couple of bits so I'll get them down for you one like Brian and Richard USA uh, there you go guys look at that beast I'm going to take you around to show you some of them now um, there might be too much wind on this one at the minute if it is I'll, uh, I'll come back and do another recording. I'll have to uh, watch this one to prove it through. But obviously you've got your uh, your steam locomotive there, your diesel one there, Union Pacific. Um, you've got this here, which is the RTV. It was like the old maglev system, which was going to be used. Uh, we had a track here in the UK for it. Um, the government didn't fund it in the end, and China and other places like that took it on, and look what they got now. But yeah. RBT, uh, RTV that used to run between a uh, testing area in uh, a place called Ely. There you go, Union Pacific engine 804. And guys, look at that view. Uh, out of bounds at the minute because of the fat asbestos and that. this bad boy. Look at that. Let's see if it says anything. Let's have a look. Pressurised one. Look at that. Look at that. Air supply. Have a look. This is a place that used to help out uh, 20 something years ago. Um, a lot has changed. A lot has changed. It'd be nice to see some of these carriages and everything up and running. Well, you know what I mean. Looking respectable again, people to look at. Uh, please keep tidy. This look. Excellent. Yeah, again, sorry if it's a bit of wind. Um, believe it or not, we moved out of this area. The wind is horrendous today here. Look at this old carriage. And this one in a minute. This is a beauty, look. 13 tons. Look at that, and look at that there. Uh, boom. Look at that. It's used as the uh, work shed now at the minute. What a beautiful cabin, eh? Look at the roof. Love it. And then some of the old lockers and everything, look. Brilliant. The old door. Needs to secure it up. And then, uh, look at this, look. It's like a, I've seen some of these made into houses. Actually, it's funny enough, there's one near where I live as well. Um, got permission to be here guys, so uh, this is why I'm having a little clamber about. I did check to see if it was okay. Uh, I'm going to be doing a bit of volunteering here. So yeah, I think I can hear a steam train coming in. Let's have a look, let's see if a steam engine's coming in. Ready? There you go, look. Santa special, guys. Got them on carriages, eh? 
And by the way, these carriages were some people were putting up but abandoned down at the uh, New Valley side when they weren't. You can tell they, they're used all the time. But yeah. I'll have to try and get that before it goes in a minute. But here's the uh, carriages, look. Brilliant, eh? I think there's a steam engine at the other end. I can see steam coming from something. We'll have a look. And this is probably going to pull off before I can get anywhere. And. There is a steam engine. Peterborough Coal. Coal and Coke Limited. Woodston Wharf, which is all this down here. Uh, sorry guys, I've got to watch where I'm walking. Um, Peterborough again, Manchester. Uh, look at that guys. smell the steam engine behind me. Right. Boom. There's the back of that. Well the car would have been on that one. Uh really someone's tried getting out the coal from this one. But I love this one. Beautiful eh? Absolutely beautiful. Right, there you go guys, so Ryan, Richard and a few other guys, here you go, a bit of that, look at that engine there, I'll catch you all on the next one, thank you very much guys, I'm going to go and try and get the steam train down now, lovely jubbly, don't forget to comment, subscribe, like and all that, I'll try and get back to you, thank you everyone.